Multiple roles for Penn State to fill this week, and they don't just stem from two season-ending injuries. At 5 o'clock, I told you about Ryan Kaiser, who fractured a rib that caused a bowel tear. He underwent surgery at Hershey Medical Center, and his family releasing a statement through James Franklin, saying that his condition is improving and that he has no infection. Zach Zwinak, of course, the other injury, the running back injured on the opening drive against Ohio State. But that's not the only area where Franklin needs someone to step up. We'll have open competition this week in practice uh, from a punting perspective. Another area that would help is just don't punt. Maybe that solution already exists in the kicking core. After Saturday's game, I asked senior place kicker Sam Ficken if he has ever punted, something the staff asked him as well. I did a little in the spring. Um, you know, obviously that's something that we need to work on. You know, uh, the guys in the locker room aren't pleased with their, their punting in the game. Um, they do it in practice well, so uh, we just need to find what, what works for them. And, you know, that's something that we'll probably focus pretty big on this, this upcoming week because that's hurting our team a little bit right now. This week it will be open competition between the two of them. You know, we'll uh, keep track of the yardage, the hang time all week long, and whoever's the most consistent guy, uh, we'll go with them. By no means is this the end for Franklin and his staff when it comes to Chris Gula or Daniel Pascarello. Franklin saying that Sam Ficken has actually been able to serve as a mentor to them as they deal with the confidence issues that go along with being a kicker. At Beaver Stadium, Ashley Chase, Six Sports.